Hello my little munchkins, my little crones, and my little chickens. How are you this fine evening? Well, I hope you are doing great. I really do. And I hope that you had a marvelous day. So with that being said, I want you to know that we're growing here a little, there a little, but every week we are growing. So it looks like we're up to 320. I can't wait till we get to 400. Yay! So with all that being said, you know, yesterday I came, you know, I didn't have my nails done and I was so embarrassed. But I did try doing a little bit. I didn't do this hand because I rushed and did it before I showed up here today. So with all that being said, we got a lot to talk about on the brown round table. And so baby phone is going to be here with us so whoo it's a lot to talk about and i can't wait to get started come on in baby crow yes can't do it without you yes yes, yes. So, you everybody know, we got to get a sound thing they go ah yes that would be great yes yes we got to get that right god i slammed myself in the back i'm like, <laughs> sorry oh my god so um, yes. so how are you? I'm good. I know you've been busy. We haven't been spending a lot of time together. I know I miss you so much because I know you've been studying. Well, is there any fun fact you could tell us about fall? Yes. Oh, so you have something. Well, my goodness. I hope it's a good one. It is a good one. So a fun fact about fall because, you know, just recently I have talked about autumn and my science recaps of the week and a fun thing about fall is next month which is october is all about coupling season Woo! yes and if what is coupling yes if you do not know what coupling is it is getting together you know coupling up in a relationship and also cuddling because of the cold weather and it's for the next few seasons because no, no, no. it's only for the fall Okay, it's only for it the It'll be over for the next month. So it really starts in October. October right. And so what coupling is, you are correct, but what coupling is, um, is where this is the time where you're starting to go out and try to find somebody to keep you during the winter months. And usually after, um, what is it? Uh, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day, Day they, they break up during February. A couple of weeks after that, mm -hmm. it's gone. It's only a winter relationship. It's only for the winter. It's only for the winter. And um, so you won't be alone. You'll have somebody to spend Christmas with, Thanksgiving with. You'll have somebody to spend yeah, so Halloween holidays. with. You'll have, yeah. So it's, it's about that Honey, buddy, that was very, very nice. So, yeah, so coupling season, and it lasts, I think, what, four months? So you got October, because it starts next month, mm -hmm. October, November, December, January, February. So what is that, five months? Yeah, five months. Wow. Well, that's enough time to fall in love and get your heart <laughs> broken. So what I'm going to tell you, be real careful during the coupling month, coupling months, because that means there's just people that's going to seem like they really want to be with you, but they only want to be with you for the winter and the fall. So be careful so you don't, you know, you know, so you don't fall so headlong. So I'm going to leave you with these words. Let a thing be a thing, okay? <laughs> Let a thing be a thing. And with that being said, let's just get started on hot topics, right? Yes. I would like to mention real quick. Of course. About the hurricane. Oh, yes, 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 yes. yes Florida yes, is yes, currently yes. in a state of emergency oh God, due to yes. Hurricane yes, e yes. Iron. It's A-I-N. Iron, 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 Iron. Yeah. She right. Because <laughs> I'm just as bad with me. So, yes, it is currently heading up through the Cubas and the Keys in the Caribbean Sea. And it's wow. planning to reach its max peak right before it hits the floor, South Florida. The Florida Keys or just Florida? Um, it's coming up past the Keys in Jackson. Well, it misses Jackson, but Miami might get hit. Oh, Jesus. Yes. Mm -hmm. And this is just right off the back. I just learned Canada on September 24th, which which was just yesterday, mm -hmm. they were also hit by a hurricane, which was Hurricane Fiona. So, yes, this is two hurricanes back-to-back -back heading near the North Americas if you're living in this region. So, mm -hmm. 
Prayers going up? Yes. Prayers going up? Come on. Mm -hmm. That no one is hurt? Yeah. No one, that there are no casualties. Casualties. Say that word. Casualties. Casualties. Thank you. <laughs> so, thank you. So, um, so before we really get started with our show, may I have a little lightning, please? Oh, yes. So we can just spark this thing up. <laughs> right. Can I do a two-hand one? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Let's give it to me, baby. I yeah. almost fell off the chair. <laughs> I got struck by lightning. I went, oh. <laughs> That's some powerful lightning we got that is today. Some powerful lightning. So, with that being said, let's just get started. Besides, we did this whole film. We did it all. Yes. And so, when we went to look at it, what happened, baby? Come. It was not viewable. It was, it was just buzzing in and out. I was so disappointed. So here we are again. So with that being said, what do you have to say about Sherry Shepard and um, and Jennifer and Jennifer Hudson show? What do you have to say? Yes, they are great shows. I currently enjoying both of them, mm -hmm. and I'm enjoying day talk daytime talk shows. They both have a different flair to them, and. What I really like about them is that they feel refreshing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are. I like that celebrities are just talking about news in a wholesome way and not dogging each other out. That is refreshing. Also, what I, I, I like about it is they're just two different shows. It's like Sherry's show is more conservative, like more... Yes. more Polished. Polished, yeah. And and Jennifer, right now, this is what it seems like to me. Let me look at it a little bit more. I've only seen a couple of them, so. Um, um, and Jennifer Hudson seemed like a more laid back, yes, kind of chill vibe. And I also like when she had um, Simon Cow on her yes. show. That really, really moved me and that they wanted to deal with that. I really like that. And another thing, um, I don't know if this is going to be a part of her show, but I did like the fact that she sang for that album. Woman. Oh yes, that was very nice. Yes, yes, yes. So two different shows, and I think they both have great potentials. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And I'm not just saying that; it, it's just refreshing because what I was thinking, oh, you got two talk shows. They're just too different. Yeah, two different. Night and day. Yes. Night and day, just nice, and it is good and refreshing. Of course, I want to hear hot topics, but I don't want to hear nobody getting beat up. Yes. I don't want to hear, you know, about my girl, Krishan, yes. beating up a girl over blue face. Yes. And I, I'm telling you, before we go on with this, I have to say, I have fell in love with yes. Krishan music. It's a vibe. I know. I know. It's a vibe. I'm, I'm into it. And um, not only that, her new song. What is yes, it? Keep Swimming. Oh, my God. I listened to that. That song is such inspirational. It's yes. such an inspirational. And I don't know how old this young lady is. And I just tell you, I I, I had no words for her. And, um, you know, I... I I just love her, and I love her music, and I definitely promote her, and uh, she has great potential, and um, and she's from Maryland, so you know <laughs> I like that too. So hey, Krishan, is that her yes, name? Yes, Krishan. Krishan Rock, if you ever in the area, she hey, is twenty two. She's so young. Give me a call. Come on my show. I adore you, sweetheart. I adore you. With that being said, um. What else we saying? So with that being said, so we love the show. Now on a sad note, this is literally sad, but I don't really know if it's sad. This is such a controversy for me. Nia Long and her oh. long time, her twelve year relationship uh, with Emmy Aduba, some foreign name. He is the lead. Nah, the, he's Leave the me alone. <laughs> Yes. Leave me alone, um, she said. Yes. Leave me alone. Respect my privacy. Just stop coming all around. <laughs> you know why? Because I think she wants to get back with them. Mm -hmm. And you know what? I hope they do. Because this was a, um, a, 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 a what is it? A, a travel relationship. What is a, yeah. a long distance relationship? Mm -hmm. They've been together for 12 years. However, I think that he should have told her. But how do you go up to tell someone? Um, honey, I, I got some bad news. Um, 
Go ahead, play it with me. Yeah. Well, you scared. You got the panic look. Okay. Honey, I got some bad news. What's the bad news? Honey, um, don't be mad. Okay. You got to start guessing okay, things. Okay, what, like, uh, what's You got to start guessing like, uh, did she, you, you got somebody pregnant, okay. start guessing okay. stuff. Okay, did you get someone pregnant? No, 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 no. Okay. So, so say, is it another woman? Is, is it another woman? Yes. This woman? Yes. Who is she? She works at the Celtics. Celtics, and she does the traveling bookings. Before we move, I just want you to know that. Yes. Now you know in real life, nobody gonna be like that. No. Right. So how do you tell someone this? Mm -hmm. And this is what everybody keeps saying. She, she should have told her, you know, yeah, you should have, could have, would have. How do you or sit down and tell know. somebody, not only was I messing with this woman, mm -hmm. not only that, I don't know if it was more than one, I'm not clear on everything yet, but not only that, but I have strong feelings for this woman. Yes. How do I sit down and tell you that? And... I done got myself tangled up, mm -hmm. so I love you, but I want her. How, how do you do it? Yes, my job is on the line. I have used this woman to help book you to move to Boston Gosh, so we can yeah. live together. So Woo. not only do I love this woman, but I was willing to give her a job to Woo. move you. Oh, Lord, 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 Lord. Yikes. Nevertheless, I don't know. If he loved me, then y'all know that I'm for love. So, you know, I don't know what it would take. I think the one thing that it would take for me to walk away, that is if you put your hands on me. Mm, that if you that. put your hands on me. Now, if you just grab me or something. Well, hopefully I won't do anything for you to have to put your paws on me. However, but if you grab me or you, but if you push me and hurt me or, or I felt scared of you for a moment. I won't stay in that. That, but if you cheat on me, I just think, and this is my own opinion, and this is what this station is about. Mm -hmm. I feel as though when you're in a relationship, sometimes infidelity creeps in. For this reason, for that reason, for the male or for the woman. The bottom line is, for me, are you willing to let that woman go? And do you love me? And are you willing to put up with me for the next year or two as I go through my not trusting you? Are you willing that you're going to have to get me everywhere you go, whatever you do, me popping up? And all? Are you willing to deal with all of the, 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 the damage that you've done? Yeah. And if he says yes, I'm willing to try. I'm not willing to take my 10-year-old away from his dad. I may have to, I may not be able to sleep in the bed with you. Mm -hmm. I may not have you touch me for a while, but are you willing to go through those stages as I forgive you? It's the, forgiving is easy. I can forgive you and truly forgive you. But it's the forgetting about it. It's the forgetting part. It's the sting of the matter. That's what takes time. Mm -hmm. And it almost feels like you didn't forgive. You did. You just can't forget. And sometimes that's what breaks the person up. Yeah. It's not that they can't forgive you. It's just that they can't forget it. They can't put it out of their mind. Some people can move past it and some people can't. However, I feel as though if they're willing to even give it a chance, I think it's okay. That's my opinion. However, they weren't married. Yeah. And he even said in his statement, I'm not sure if he said this just because he was suspended from being coach, but mm -hmm. he said that he understands the Celtics and the He NBA's. knew the rules. Yep. He so, knew the rules. So he accepts his punishment and he will wait out the season. Sad. 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 That's all I got for that. Mm -hmm. um, now, um... So, yeah, so that's really bad about the NBA coach. I'm so sorry. Well, what about Tiffany Haddish? Oh, yes, another scandal oh, in the news. Oh, Another person, actually, who lost their job oh, to a scandal. Oh, Tiffany Haddish is claiming she doesn't have a job now. 
Mm. But she paid out outside of court. Did I say it? Did I call it? Did I call it? Did Lady Cone call it in her reading? Yes. She was so desperate, guys. Now, this is a momentary thing. Yeah. I don't think that, you know, people are starting to say things like, well, Tiffany Haddish wasn't as bad as Aries. It's not about the bad. It's not about that. Everyone predicted It's just it. the fact that you were in it. Mm -hmm. However, all I say for me, for me, think the way you want, but don't judge me. Back 10 years ago, pedophilia wasn't like it is today. No. Who would think in their right frame of mind that would make a skit like that and put it on TV? You're right. Or who would do that? Ooh. See, I think that we, so you gotta have mercy because blessed are the merciful. For they shall obtain mercy. I'm not saying that these people ought not get punished. I'm not saying that. I am saying, but forever and ever, amen? 30 years, 20 years, banished from her job? Consider the age. Anyone that's 40 years and over, we came from some crazy times. Okay? So, people in your age, that's all you know about the Me Too movement, yes. right? Mm -hmm. What about a Me Too movement? Me Too, I Too, been, you know, yes. and, and I guess everybody has so many years, people have set on, and, 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 and men that have set on um, other men taking advantage of them, and being by Grandpapa, mm -hmm. and Uncle Sam, and being by uh, Aunt Becky. I guess all these things, and people set on that because it was nowhere to go, but we're living in a different day and time, and I'm telling you, today there is no excuse for no one. So all I'm saying, and I even feel like, I'm going to say it, I even feel like that for uh, R. Kelly, I do. I just think they get a bad rap for things that was going on. I mean, men were marrying 13-year-olds. Yeah, that is very true. Back in the 50s, I mean... I don't know. Back just, in the 60s. It's it just, just seems sad. like people of color seem to get a little bit more harder when it comes they to take, these allegations. Absolutely. They take the blunt, the, the blunt of the blow. Somebody has to represent the negativity and they give it to the black man. And that's just the way it's been. Mm -hmm. It's been, that's just the way it's been. So, um, you know, I hope that I don't come off as a racist or a colorist or anything like that. I'm not. It's just that this country is so divided and everything with color is so hard to escape it. It is. I mean, we are so divided. Like, it's just who Actually, that reminds me mm -hmm. because of talking about wrongs and rights and real in, in the world brings me to the baby talking about in a song how he allegedly slept with Megan the oh, Stallion the night before he tell. got shot by Tory Lanez. But who kiss and tell though? Exactly. But I tell you one thing. I saw Megan the Stallion in what? what was in the 22, that 2022 body, Billboard Awards. That Wars. body, 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 yes. body, body, uh, body. That body was snatched. I mean, she had those straps on and not, not a piece of meat came out nowhere. Slim, yes. oh my God. She is gorgeous. Her body, oh my God. Oh, totally. And to me, this is the best I've ever seen her body. Yes. Meg Thee Stallion, you're the girl. Mm -hmm. Meg Thee Stallion, yes. you're the girl that men mm -hmm. want to take home. Okay. Mm -hmm. Even to mother, <laughs> you know, beautiful body, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Woo! And she's tall and statuesque, mm -hmm. right? Beautiful. Like Fifty Cent said. <laughs> now, on a lighter note, Fifty Cent and The Rock said, mm -hmm. yeah, "I can see it. This girl has got body, 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 uh, body, 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 body. She's got it. And when she made that song, she was built. But now, oh mm -hmm. my God." Girl, what's your regimen? Tell me so yes. I can have it. What you eating? Mm -hmm. Girl. So with that being said, 
And on a lighter note, what do you think about Trissy Teigen? Trissy, what's her name? Chrissy Teigen. Chrissy Teigen. What do you think about that, that uh, girl? She's a little nutty for me. She is. Um, yeah, it's you, a little nutty. It's a common theme you say when people step outside their race to go date that strange meat. Um, John Legend, I don't know who you picked up. <laughs> ah! <laughs> for real. And you playing along with it, too. That is a... Look, Chrissy... Oh. I don't know, girl, but why would you film yourself mourning yes. a baby, allowing us to think that you had a miscarriage, miscarriage. and it was Trissy yes. Teague. And now you she got you cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, girl, and you sitting up there crying, lit tears. Yes. And who, taking the girl. In black yeah. and white for cinematic effect, too. And what I understand, that these are the things she is known to do. Things like this. Yes. Girl. What's her husband's name? John Legend. He goofy. <laughs> he goofy. John Legend. John. Girl, John. John. Woo. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I don't even know. You know how you think of. She just goofy. Just. She. Goofy. Just. <laughs> and then the, and the thing that he actually bought she into. She seemed like a he, sweet girl though. Uh, yeah. She gotta yeah. be when you're dizzy. She just. Do things that, 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 like she's camera stalled. Yeah, it could seem like that. It's like addicted like that. To, to that. Why? Why would you want, and one of the most saddest things, obviously it wasn't said, you, you fake like it was said. Mm -hmm. Why would you lie and want to play on people's sympathy? Girl, you got issues. See a therapist. Seek a therapist, for real. And John Legend... Man, you need to be able to get a hold of your wife and talk to her because y'all two look silly. Just downright silly. And I don't know if this girl got an issue, but I heard that she is known for that. Now that she has done this, I'm going to be looking out for you, Chrissy. And if you do something really, really silly again, I'm coming in because this is ridiculous. And why would you play on a soul? Right. That you mm -hmm. that 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 ooh, 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 ooh. And uh, it's even more confusing because uh, now why is it being exposed after uh, rights have been taken away? She she said it. She and her goofy self, that's why I'm calling her goofy. She came back and said, Oh, it wasn't a miscarriage. John told me it wasn't a it wasn't a miscarriage. It wasn't like you didn't know. See, that's what I'm saying. I can't. I can't. I mm. can't with her. She just, oh. Mm, mm, mm. Just like I can't with Tori Lanez and August Alsina. Oh. Again, Tori Lanez here. First allegedly shooting Megan Thee Stallion and now attacking August Alsina. Because. <laughs> you know what? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's had him slain. Man. If it was me, I would sue Tori Lane. You hear me? Yeah, Tori, you oh. need to just chill, honestly. I don't know. Napoleon. And your hype crew you got around you. Who? They hyped him up for this. Yes. Because they stroke his ego. <laughs> that little. But, um, yes, it was all because allegedly, um, in a song... Tory Lanez, yeah. yeah, a few years ago, was talking about August Alsina and Jada, and how he doesn't talk about kiss and tell. Yeah, kiss and tell. And so when he went by August, he he, he well, when August walked by him with his little pink teddy bear, his pink so, so sweet boy. That's a sweet boy. He's sweet boy. He he like a. He's just sweet. I mean, to me. the view of Jada, you have to be a peace hippie. Yeah, and hippie and dippy that. type, right? Mm -hmm. And so when he walked by. Him, Corey, Troy mm -hmm. Wang, and he, he didn't do anything. He just kept on mm -hmm. walking. It's like, I don't feel you, you know, like, I don't feel you like that, you yeah. know. I don't, you know, and he mind his business. And they got Corey, Troy Lang all pumped up like a little Napoleon. He was like a Tasmanian devil. Just, shoo, 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 just what? And, and of all people, you hit that little sunflower. I just have an issue with it. And I'm saying it because he's a tender soul. Mm -hmm. He just seems like about love and peace. He doesn't seem like he's about fighting and all that. Mm -hmm. Look how Jada done hurt the man and all the things that he has gone through with his family. He's just a tender soul. Yeah. 
and I and I and, and he's he's a sunflower. He just want to spit out seeds of love and spiritualism, you know, and 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 leave August alone, you know. So, mm, you know. Well, anyway, now that I think of August, I don't think that's a good name to name somebody. I'm going to tell you why. why. Because August means things begin to die. Oh, yeah, that is true. See, August take you into fall. It's one of those transitional months. What is it? It's like a cardinal? No. Things. It's fixed. It's it's a, no, it's not fixed because it's the end. August. Oh, we in September. Mm -hmm. Right. So August is a fixed month. Mm -hmm. So it's, well, okay, I take it back. Then it's good. Because it's fixed. It's stable. It doesn't have no challenges. It just takes you through the month because it is fixed. You are right. So yeah, whereby I'm a Sagittarius. So I'm not. I'm mutable. So you know, I got a big mouth. Hey, hey, holly, hi, hey, hey, winter's coming. Winter's coming. That That's me, right? Yeah. Ah, ah. So anyway, <laughs> With that being said, I'm so glad that I'm in a good mood. And like I said, I don't like what what was Christy doing. I don't like it. Tory Lanez, is that his name? Yes, Tory, Tory. Tory. I don't like it. You're a bully. And I think that if I was um, August, I would sue him. You know, I don't care. Mm -hmm. I would sue him because you really knocked that man out. You beat his face up. You mm -hmm. messed him up. That was not cool at all. And I don't like you anymore. Even though, Corey, you cute. I'm, that's why you're not tall. <laughs> That's why you not tall. See, see, you be too dangerous. See, when they made you, they knew this is just some little karma that you have. You're a very handsome man. Definitely. Definitely handsome. But you short. Mm -hmm. So anyway, with that August outstanding, I feel bad about that. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So let's just pray us go up for August because yes. poor thing is traumatized. Mm -hmm. I know he was traumatized. <laughs> Bloody mouth, Torval. And you know he probably ain't fight him. Me all messed up. He was injured. Yeah, for real. He was really beat up. I yeah. mean, for real. And they was laughing. I just... Ooh. And Tori came out looking unscathed. <sighs> That's that Negro sugar honey iced tea, you know. Um, well, anyway, here we go again. Ray J, we got to talk about oh, it. Yes, he was on the... um. What was it? On Hell of a Week with Charlemagne. Which I like Charlemagne's show. I think Charlemagne is called for it. He is very good. But I, people said that um, they felt like uh, Charlemagne um, made, um, um, what's his name? Ray J. Ray J. look bad. What do you think? Um... I don't think so. I feel like the way he phrased his question, mm -hmm. because he said that he noticed Ray J exposed the lie right before... This is what Charlemagne said, yes. And he was asking Ray J, did he plot this for the Kardashian storyline? Because he released the news right before the new season started. And Ray J said that would make sense. But it doesn't because they would be, if that was true, why wouldn't they be suing me? Instead, I'm suing them. And he also said it wouldn't make sense. He said, I only did it because she, I caught her on that thing lying. Mm -hmm. Fake lying. When it was supposed to him and Tim, when Kim had told him that it was over, then you ain't got to worry about it. But then Kim came on starting the season. Lying about the robot, Ro Roblox, yes. Roblox, and then then on that Morgan, what's his name? Um, James Gordon. Jane Gordon show this. It was just too much, and I think he just popped, and he just happened to be away when it happened. Mm -hmm. Now let me tell you how I feel about it. A lot of people feel like he he was like a lamb to the slaughter. That that um, Charlemagne um, really did him in. Let me tell you how I seen this. Well, actually. I had I already believed that Charlemagne always make Ray J look like he don't respect him as a man. Yeah. 
because he was just on there and Charlemagne always seemed to talk down to him. And I know that Charlemagne tend to do that to people that are not confrontational. Mm -hmm. And it just seems to me Ray J is not a confrontational person like that. So it's like he'll laugh things off. Yeah. But I know for a fact that Ray J is the devil himself incarnate. Mm -hmm. And I know that he's the angel. I know that about him because no matter what, he was on that show and I know, and he even issued out apology to uh, uh, um, Charlemagne about, about what he said because he was very offended. Mm -hmm. I thought to me, what Charlemagne did for me, you all could take it the way you want to take it, but for me, it's like if he was on a court, mm -hmm. like if you go on a court, challenge what you're doing. And I think Ch Charlemagne challenged that. Yeah, it was a good point, Kevin. Yeah, well. Challenged that. Because if you can't stand up to what I'm going to do, you better be careful when you take them to court. That's how I took it. And when Ray J was like, oh, I wasn't ready, he was falling all on the chair. He handled himself very good. He, he said, Charlemagne, because some stuff he didn't want to talk about it. And Charlemagne mm -hmm. was like, then why you come on in? Right. So he's like, you're right. I thought that they were good. Like I said before, I always felt like Charlemagne talked down to Ray J. I said it. Mm -hmm. Ray J, take it. Yeah. Because he can. some people can handle stuff like that, you know. Mm -hmm. You know me, I cop an attitude. I've been to say something, you know. You know, he been to say something to me out of the way. And I be like, what? That is so uncalled for. I, I, I know me. So, um... So I, I I thought that I thought it was good. I thought yeah, it was, it was funny. Good. I thought it was entertaining. And yes, did he challenge Ray J? Mm -hmm. Of course. Should he have? Yes. Did it look like he was for the Kardashians? No. It looked like man, no. What for me? Like a subliminal man. You know they're a powerful couple, man. I hope you know what you're doing. That's what I got out of it. And if and, and what I'm asking you, man, you know. And, and and like Ray J said, I'm standing on truth. Yeah. So you, no matter if I, what I hear Ray J saying, I can't spill enough. Mm -hmm. I can't talk enough. Why? Because I speak truth. I can't spill enough. And the truth is the truth is the truth. Yeah. And the truth is the light. And the light, what? Will shine. So he's standing on that. And he's standing on God got my back about this. Yes. But, Ray J, you're going to have to take this to court. It's time to get a lawyer. Sure. I, I, I think he already has somebody looking yeah, into you're, this already. You're not going right? to get that public apology. You're not going to get it. I'm, I'm gonna, I already read her cards and she said... It'll be a dark day and a funky moon before she give you a apology. That's my sister Angie. God bless her soul. But um, yes, so you're not getting it. So like she said, the only way you'll get it, you'll take me to court. And by and proving then, that I'm wrong, then that's how you got your apology. Because you proved that. We were wrong. And if you so right about this, if you feel so good and you feel mm -hmm. like you got it like that, take me to court. Right. Because Kardashians are going to find that. Legal. This is what I hear. I feel like she's saying, look, you're not going to bully me. Mm -hmm. I'm not giving you what you want. You can't bully me. You already heard us shook us. You rattled our cages. But that's it. Because she's like, I, I did. She's like, I did dog triple day. You take me to court. She ready. She like, because the cards came out. And the cards is like, I'm ready. There's two sides to a story. And she's saying, you, you, you may have, I know the thing with her is the contract. But I don't know, have Ray J, this is the thing that has me concerned. I don't know if this is real or not. Because Ray J said that he hadn't spoken to her in 20 years. Mm-hmm. But that has been proved to not be so. Yes. So what I want to know is, have Ray J ever called her for a sexual favor and she declined? Well, as you see in one of the DMs that was exposed, right. that he did ask Kim, because mm -hmm. he was in town, if he wanted to, if they wanted to hook up and she never responded back. And then she... And that's what kind of like triggered him, right? Mm -hmm. Because maybe he just wanted to get to her to talk about it. I don't know. I don't know. But we don't know that. This is why all this needs to go to court. 
and he has right. He, he is correct when he said, out of all of this, how come nobody hasn't taken me to court? Exactly. But I think it's time for him to chill mm -hmm. and go to court. I, I really, I, 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 I really do. I don't know, and I'm, and 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 we'll see. Like I said, give it a couple of weeks, but uh, we'll see. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Yeah. You think he's gonna take them, or you just think he's just blowing out smoke? Uh, he better take them because he is so standing strong on that he needs his name cleared for his kids. So if you're that serious, then you need to take this to court. How long you think you're gonna just sit there and badger these people about an apology? Mm -hmm. That you know now you're not going to get. It's about, what, 13 days now? You're not going to get it. So, we'll see. I just think it's interesting. I got a pen in that. We're definitely following that story. What do you think? Yes. Okay, so that was good. Okay, what do you have to say? Oh, let me say this about Kanye West. Oh, How about ye? He's going around making some kind of apology to Kim. I'm sorry. Yada 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 yada. Yeah. What do you think? What's, what do we think about Kanye? What do you think? What um, do you think? honestly, it it sounds kind of fishy in my opinion because I don't understand how you said. Oh, yes, I understand that. Kim is stressed out at the moment. Everybody can see Kim is stressed out at the moment. Because but, of this thing with Ray J. Right, but to tell everybody, oh, that's the wife of my children. Don't stress her out. I apologize for stressing her out. So does that mean you're the only one allowed to stress her out? Does okay. it mean that y'all going to get back together? Because if y'all get back together, I think that's fabulous. Yes, oh, and we just saw Because who won her? Yep. Who want this woman? We just saw you... Kanye posts a picture of Kim Kardashian on your Instagram and she was posing for Balenciaga. The thing about Kanye to me is I'm going to just leave it alone. All I hope that you get your Kim and your family and when you get her back if you should get her back because clearly she needs you so if you should get her back or win her back or whatever this is and you going around talking about i don't want her back say that lie for somebody else that's stupid you want her back you would do anything to get her back you done already came out and publicly announced that tall statuette model from um south africa uh -huh. what's her name um candace Swan pill. Right. He already said we're just friends. Oh, because I was just thinking. Yeah. I was like, yeah. what yeah. happened to that yeah. girl? He, he, is he doing this to get Kim back? If they get back together, I hope so. I think it's wonderful. It's because crazy. Kim did say, or allegedly, or what I heard that Kim said, the, the her, she is holding back on the procedures of the divorce. Mm -hmm. However, I want them to get him back. He gets a chance to get a do-over. She scared him. I don't know how he can go back to it, but nevertheless... I want them to get back together, and I'm out of it. I'm out. I'm, yeah. I'm out. You go back to that woman, I'm done with you. I wash. I'm done. I wash my hands. Twice, I'm done. There will not be a third time. I love you, Kanye. I really do. But to me, it just seems like you say you do this for your children. The bottom line, you seem like a man that's in love with your wife. And in a video that I said early on, I said that I think that they'll get back together. Mm -hmm. However, I don't know if they're going to get back together or not. I just feel as though you should. You got four kids. Those kids need a family. Mm -hmm. Y'all can figure it out. Y'all got enough money. Y'all can't figure this out. Y'all can't stay married and be social and 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 do y'all thing and respect one another for, and be there for the kids with all that money y'all have. Uh -huh. <sighs> mm -mm -mm. If y'all love y'all kids, y'all will work it together. I can see it. I can see it if. If, if not, Kanye, you said you're going to do better. You get her back, do better. Please. Just be an ass kisser. <laughs> Just be whatever you say, Kim. Yes. But not with your money. But whatever you say, Kim. Yes, yes. that's what pleases Kim. 
Whatever you say, Kim. Yes. Be a Corey. Like the mother. What's her, her boyfriend name? Corey. Corey. Be a Corey. It'll work. It'll work. Well, anyway, I wish them the best. With that being said, um, what do you want to say about Thomas? Um, um, Tristan, Thomas, oh, and Chloe. What do you yes. guys say about them? Tristan, oh, Chloe. <laughs> I don't know what you doing, girl, because you're saying she was crying. Like, I get it. You, you're hurt by it, but she was just like, I'm not even sure if I should say I and Tristan are having a baby. And then she was just like, I had a baby. I'm like, oh, and now you're just cutting him out of the process? This is the thing that I hate about women. You wanted to have a baby so bad because y'all Kardashians don't believe in having mixed fathers. Y'all feel as though it's so disgusting when women, especially black women, have more than one daddy. Not mentioning that your mama could have did it. Okay, but exactly. nevertheless, I have no proof Swept allegedly. Swept that under the rug. Yeah. So y'all got this issue where y'all want all y'all children by one man. So now you got your child by Tristan, your boy and your girl. Yes. Girl, all I'm saying is, it sounds to me as depressed as you were. I'm going to say it. Sound like you ain't want the baby. It sound like it was a big mistake. You were so depressed, you didn't want it. And I'm going to put it out there. And you know what? I understand. Had you had a known, you would have never did it. And I truly believe if you was pregnant, if you had gotten pregnant, you probably would have. I think that I really do believe it because you was in a sunken place. Yep, yeah, because she said it in the video. She said, well, in the trailer. When she said it was too late. It was nothing I could do because somebody else. You couldn't go, well, oh, mm -hmm. I spent all this money. Um, I don't want it. You were stuck. And yep. you know what? A lot of people understand that, Chloe. You were stuck. And you resented. That's why you didn't want no baby showers. That's why you didn't want nothing. That's why you didn't want to deal with the public. You didn't want to feel even worse. But now you got that baby. You love that baby, Chloe. It's going to be hard. Because he is a constant reminder of what you did. Mm -hmm. Of what you did to yourself. You did this. He was a cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater before you got pregnant. And, and, and you went and you did it behind the public's back. So live with it. You love that baby boy. You hear me? You love him, Chloe. You love him. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, oh, yeah. Speaking of Trish, because I almost forgot, he was spotted with an OnlyFans model. Now, yeah. we're not sure if that's... He, I, 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 the way I understood, they were just hanging out together. Oh, okay. But you know what? He, he can't control his people. He's a child. Any man that just keeps... I mean, and, and the thing that gets me with these men, they be getting into this fawns women. Yeah, let you on top of that. Ooh, I don't know if I would feel comfortable with it. I, I don't know. They like the exotic differentness. Know. And we already talked about the baby in a song sleeping with Meg the Stallion. Yeah, how ironic the name of the that song is so called Boogie Man. That is so stupid. Who does that? Who yeah. does that? Well, look like we done gotten everything out of the way. Yes, is there anything else? No. Um, it looked like we got everything. It looked like we got yeah. all the hot I just want to throw out my two cents out there about Adam Levine and oh, his yes. relationship. Yes, yes, yes. I want to do a reading. When somebody asked me for a reading. When I'm finished with this, I'm going to do a quick reading on them. Go ahead, yes. Yes, Adam Levine from Maroon 5 has allegedly cheated on his was wife. It, was it, did he cheat or was it just phone cheating? Or was it actually an affair? Um, it was flirtatious. No, because the woman that came out said that they were together for a year. And he never knew that she was, that he was in a relationship. And didn't he call her back and ask her permission to use her baby, her name, to name his baby? Mm -hmm. <sighs> yep. And now you know, why are you going to do this, lady? Why do you women mess with married men and then tell? Stop it. And it wasn't even recent. It was a while.
while ago, and she's just bringing it up now. Because he oh, called him. Yes, because he's having a baby, and he was so in love with her. He was like, can I name my daughter after you? I don't think he was in love with her. I think he loved her. He liked her name. What was the bad name? Rain? Um, Sumner. Like, it's Are they going to still keep the name, or are they going to name it something else? Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I, I thought it was the name was going to be Rain, but it could be Sumner. Because I think whatever it was, like, I still want to keep the name. I, I don't know about that. But anyway, yeah, I want to do a reading on Adam Levine. Um, I don't know what's going on in his life, what's going on. He's very attractive, man. But uh, let's see what's going yeah. on. And also, someone wanted a reading of Mike Tyson. I was like, Mike Tyson, I love Mike Tyson. I think he's very wise, down to earth, to the point, but I want to do, I'm going to do the reading on Adam Levine, and we're going to see what's going on in his life. But right now, we got everything we yes. needed out of the brown round. Yes, yes, yes. It seemed like it went so fast. It and did. we had like 10 topics. And we went through all of them. Well, I can't think of anything else to say at this moment. Yes. But it was so enjoyable to get caught up on everything. Mm -hmm. um, I enjoy our chats. Chats, please, why don't you, if you dare, hit me up for a reading. I have this special. It's going to be there for a while until I can build a book. Help me. I need, I don't need, I really want to be able to do readings. You know, they're $10. Yes. Is it okay for me to do it or mm -hmm. do I look like I'm no, being desperate? No, no, I'm just rendering a service and um, I'm rendering a service and that service is I do do readings and counseling with it. $10, you know, we'll see what's going on with you and we can get to the bottom of things. Pretty good at what I do. Um, also, I'm going, um, I'm going to do, we did talk about this, so we're going to do a podcast, mm -hmm. but that is going to be like reading over the air and it's going to be more astrology and cards. So we're going to be going into that direction in a couple of months mm -hmm. as soon as we get everything together when Baby Crone is got school all together we're yes. going to go we just don't want to take on too much right now mm -hmm. so with that being said we thank you so much yes. for for subscribing thumbing us up we so appreciate it we really do we adore you we love you my little munchkins my little crones and my little chickens i have 300 we yes has 300 and 20 people that we have to minister to. Mm -hmm. I like to think if I had to go into a church or organization and there was 325 people, that would be a lot of people. It would be, wouldn't it? Yes. So please, keep coming in. Anything you want to know, ask a question. Anyone you want me to read about, you know I love reading. <laughs> Ask the question. If you want a reading, ask me a question. If you want me to do a reading for you over the air, just put it in there and I would read for you. So with all that being said, I thank you so much for all over the world, whoever listens to, the, to Lady Crone and Baby Crone. We so appreciate you. We thank you so much. Keep coming back for more and more and more and watch us grow. Yes. So with that being said, thank you and we'll see you soon. Ciao. Ciao. One day we're going to have somebody that's going to be able to do that.